Sometimes the difference between jumping to conclusions and finding creative solutions can be the difference between night and day. To shed some light on the subject, let's spend a quality minute with Howland Blackiston. In Thomas Jefferson's time, patriots defended our nation's capital from the invading British. More recently, the Park Service had to defend the Jefferson Memorial from invaders of another sort. The stone in this building was crumbling. What could be causing this decay? It turns out that it was actually the frequent washings of the stone that was creating the problem. The reason they washed it so often was because there were so many bird droppings on the building. Then they asked themselves, well, why are there so many birds in the building? There's an abundant food supply. Hundreds and hundreds of little fat spiders. So then they asked themselves, why are there so many spiders? The spiders were attracted by the midges, thousands of tiny little insects. So they asked themselves, why are there so many midges? Every evening at dusk, millions of these midges emerge in a mating frenzy. Also, at the same time every evening, the National Park Service turns on the powerful spotlights that illuminate the monument. Well, the excited midges are attracted to the light. The solution? The Park Service has delayed the daily lighting of the structure to one hour after sunset. The midge population is down 90%, they've broken the food chain, and there are less frequent washings. So, make sure you're working with all the information and get to the true root cause of the problem. The results can be literally night and day. For Duran Institute, I'm Howland Blackiston with another Quality Minute.